Hey, two guys, two shawarma. <laughs> We're out here at Costco. You know, we're just making the other guy shop because if he doesn't know last year, the only people that ever went to Costco was me and Robo, and we had that stuff down to the science, and they're not respecting us, so we'll let them do it themselves. I'm gonna kick my feet up, then stare at the fan, turn the TV on, throw my hand in. On a scale of 1 to 10, how mad do you think James is? I'd say 9. I would say 54. Look, just look at him over there. Just look at him. Dude, we let you shop and you rack up a $400 bill? What's this about? So keeping up with the theme of going to sporting events, James, Nate, and I are going to the wrestling match tonight. Uh, there's two guys on the team that we're friends with that are big supporters of the channel, so we really wanted to make it out to a match. Michigan versus Penn State. Shout out Nick Freeman and Mason Paris. Those kids are huge. Wouldn't want to get in a scrap with them at the bar. And I don't know if Nate and James know a lot about wrestling, but I wrestled in middle school. I sucked, but I have the utmost respect for those guys. Like, I'd have a three-minute match, and I'd be feeling like I just played 90 minutes of soccer after three minutes. But I need you guys to stop what you're doing and comment and thank Robo. He's made, like, the past three videos, and he's picking up my slack because I'm being lazy. So just comment right now. Thank you, Robo. We'll see you guys at the meet. Do you guys think there will be a line like last time? I was here last time. I don't know. People aren't hip to the wrestling meet. You didn't watch the video, Nate? You can see the line. I did watch the video. Oh, so then what do you mean you don't know? What do you mean, Nate? What do you mean you don't know? Tell me what you mean by that. What do you mean by that you don't know? Tell me what you mean. Don't, hey, I'm trying to watch. It's mean. cold, man. Tell me what you mean. It's cold. I don't want to be messed with right now. It's too cold for this shit. Get it, Rolo! Come on! Ah! Mason Paris, you got the WWE shit. This is the man we came to see, this is the man you came to see. Oh boy, don't step in the ring with That's how I shoot, dude. I got some cheeseburger from Chrysler. I have no idea how good it is, but I give it a review. But I'll tell you one thing: it's not as good as Lori Gold Farm's cooking right now. I know that for a fact. <laughs> I would give it like a seven. That's an amateur score. What do you want? You think it was a seven point two or something? I can't throw a... mm. It's a seven. You I told me that shitty burger is a seven. Mm. It's better than I thought it was gonna be. Robo. It's better than I thought it was gonna be, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be really bad, it's not. That did pretty good. Oh yeah, Mason! Alright, good morning YouTube. It's uh, about 1.30, we're getting the day started. But, more importantly, this is for all of our female viewers. I wanna show you guys one of the biggest red flags you'll ever see in a male. Look at this closet, okay? First things first, if you walk into a dude's closet, and just for reference here, if his dirty clothes are piled up about halfway the length of the closet, okay, that right there is a number one red flag, okay? He does not love you, okay? He does not love you at all. all right, yeah. But I'm gonna show you an even worse red flag. When you see him with his toes out in his slides every single day, I don't know. <laughs> that is a much worse red flag. I'm pushing PR on favorite out. Let's go. 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 Let's